let, let me Salam lakul kamu. Salam lakul kamu. Fahami Fahami. We are going live from uh, the Fahami Temple of Divine Understanding, World Headquarters in uh, St. Louis, Missouri. It's my honor and pleasure to introduce our speaker, our lecturer, uh, Hi Sheikh and Sheikh Amsi Manu Ra. The title of our Enlightenment, our lecture is called Evolve and Revolve with Understanding. Please, everyone, uh, rise and uh, welcome our Sheikh Amsi. somewhat in a state of revolution. Mm. Revolution means to change. Also means to turn. You can turn slowly or you can turn more rapidly. Okay. But all revolution means is to change. of the human race has 
been evolved from the universal cosmic man. And every individual unit, that means every individual on this earth, is a center to which the cosmic conscious, the ethereal or brain of creation, expresses itself. All of you out there is a unit. All of you who are human on this earth is an individual center to which the great God, the great man above, expresses himself in this world. Mm -hmm. Our holy Fahami Rasul informs us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let there be a good neighbor policy between peoples of all colors. And there should be a good neighbor policy between Christians and Mohammedans of all races, creeds, and colors that they might understand. That means we should all try to get along. Uh -huh. And say if you're on the same job with someone that's of a so-called other race, if you're in the same school with someone of another race, mm -hmm. you are in the same church with someone of another race. You can even marry if you want to someone of another race. That means they will come to a better understanding of each other. You have to co-intermingle with each other to learn how to get along or learn how to understand or know each other. Yeah. Islam, Isis El Am, is the mother of all religions. It ascended out of Ham, or Kim. Jacob chose Islam and called it Israel, or Israel. And Jesus chose Islam and called it Christ. Muhammad chose Islam as the religion of the earth. But the religion or culture of the ancient Ethiopian, ancient black people, was Islam. The understanding of Fahami will unite the different states of religious minds in peace. Fahami will bring us all together in peace. Peace, which is Islam, seems to be such a fleeting thing in today's world. The diabolical few among us, the mischief makers and power mongers, have exercised greed and control to promote evil through ignorance, fear, and religious intolerance among the nations of the world. Know this, O oh my beloved sons and daughters of Ethiopia. Ethiopia and Egypt was and is one and the same land. I'm dead. Mm -hmm. In ancient times, the land that extended downward and north from the Ethiopian highlands with the Nile River as its guide and flowed all the way to the north to what is now above Cairo was by Europeans historians called Upper Egypt but was known to the native inhabitants the blacks as Ethiopia. The blue heaven or sky was called the 
sea of God. The Milky Way was called the river of heaven. The sun was called the all-seeing eye of God. Isis was called his wife. The stars, their children. Now, the face of more than half of these people, the blacks, are and were alien to Western civilization. Western civilization knew of these faiths of Africa, or knew of these faiths of Ethiopia, but they didn't know anything about them. Me and Imam Kim Su was talking about this a little earlier. Me and Brother Ali was talking about it earlier. They, they knew about them, but they didn't know a thing about them. <laughs> they thought they knew, but they didn't know a thing about them. But to the different faiths of the land of Ham, which is Africa, no matter how, no matter how unfamiliar their beliefs, and however that divided into re different religions and sects, these Hamites, or black people, they sought the truth. But truth means different things to different people. The word truth itself, different connotations in the civilizations of the East, from these those of the West, but always it means a search for answers to the mysteries of reality, mm -hmm. of the soul, of the purpose of life. Mm -hmm. Today the nations which follow the nations, which follow the ancient religions, are researching and ambitious. And in today's world, no nations are remote. Every nation on earth can be reached. None is out of touch with each other. All can be reached. It is important to understand their behavior. But first, we must know what they believe. Before you can understand someone's behavior, you must understand their beliefs. Mm -hmm. Religion does not explain everything about a people's behavior. But as the mother of morals and definer of justice, it has ever been chief arbiter of man's conduct. Mm -hmm. You can go anywhere in the world and study anyone's conduct anyone's behavior and the root of the way they act and the way they talk is grounded in their religion and in what they believe. Mm -hmm. As it was revealed to our holy Fahami Rasul, mm -hmm. may the peace and the blessings of the Most High be upon him. Mm -hmm. As he informed us that any person you read about was not the first person to bear that name. Mm -hmm. There were people named Asa, Musa, Hathor, Jesus, Isis, Muhammad, Brahma, Cain, Enoch, Jehovah, Jesus, El, and so forth, long before those you read about were born. I'm there. When leaders and speakers come to you, colored or otherwise, from America, from India, Egypt, China, Japan, Burma, and Madagascar, to Mexico, the Philippines, or whatnot, if they are against me, they are against me. If they are jealous of me, they are jealous of you. Mm -hmm. Be careful with them where 
whether they are Muslims, Jews, Hindus, Christians, Japanese, or Mohammedans. If they fight me, they will fight you. Words and names are the keys to all understanding. They are weapons of offense and they are weapons of defense. Different races exist in name only because in reality there is nothing but one race. Some names are a handicap to individuals and nations. To change your condition, change your name. The names of most countries have been changed. Millions of people know not where or the land of Caribbean, Cush, Nod, Salem, or Babylon. Mm -hmm. The land of Nod is a part of Egypt. Mm -hmm. The land of Nuit or Neith. One husband and one wife is the ideal marriage. Mm -hmm. For a people's strength is in their women. Eden is Aten. Mm -hmm. Ethiopia, Amin, Amin. And Amin means really the universe, the worlds, and all of the planets. Amin is the universe personified as Al Alamin, the Lord I'm of dead. the world. Mm -hmm. The religion with God is peace. The first and oldest town or city in the world was Enoch. Built by Cain's son, Enoch. He named the town after the city that he built. The great pyramid, like his predecessors, stand like milestones, making the long road by which man passed from barbarism to a highly developed civilization. It evolved. Mm -hmm. We learn thus what were the visible things that we must understand as making up civilization in the beginning. But there were some things necessary which were highly developed and some things that were highly developed were not visible. These were a belief in right living and kindness to others. And that a good life here was necessary to happiness in the next world. To the heart. At the close of the Giza period, a wise man said, Established is the man whose standard is righteousness mm -hmm. and who walketh according to its way. When the necessity came for the American Kemite, the so-called Negro, to have a spiritual leader, a prophet, God gave a scripture, the book and the wisdom, to one who was born and lived a lifetime among them. In this age, meaning this time, this revolution, this time around, he, the Almighty God, has sent to you the Fahami prophet to lighten the way for the Hamites, the Ethiopians, the Mingo people, and the Negroes, the blacks of the West. Andrew. Pauline Johnson is that prophet. Andrew. The Fahami prophet, the cultural prophet of the Hamites. Ethiopian race in this age, this time, 
this round. Mm -hmm. He is the first and only man to formulate a creed for blacks, so-called Negroes, in the history of the world. The first and only man to introduce ancestor worship among the Hamites, the Negroes, in the history of the world, mm -hmm. combined with a rigid monotheism. Mm -hmm. The so-called Negroes own the salvation. Mm -hmm. Hell is the sun, mm -hmm. the Christ, and not a place of punishment. Mm -hmm. You've been taught that hell is a place of punishment. That is not necessarily so. Hell is not a place of punishment. Punishment is in the world. And happiness is in the world. When you're having good times, you are happy. When you're having bad times, that is hell. But it's just, hell is something just, that is just not so good. That's what hell in hell is, so to speak. Alu, the paradise of Allah, the one true God, Amra. The eternal fire of God is not a hell. It is the light of the world, the sun, the giver of life by Allah's permission. Ham, the father of Cush, which is Ethiopia, and Mizraim, which is Egypt, and Futa, which is Canaan, and Canaan, and, and Futa, which is Arabia, and Canaan, which is Palestine, all of which are combined into the one name, Fahami. Fahami. Fahami is the foundation of the so-called Negroes, evolution and revolution. The Negro must evolve under the banner of Fahami. Fahami is the foundation of culture and religion. A God-sent messenger is a prophet. A prophet is above an ordinary preacher. A messenger of a God comes with new knowledge. Knowledge that the world has not known before. New knowledge of government, of nations, of religions, of science, and theology, of time, dimension, and space. Hear this now and know. And the thunders told them of it. The lightning warned them. Still they went headlong into destruction. Religious differences are not now and will be, they are all coming to an end. Quarreling among the creeds is over. All shall concentrate on self-preservation and the welfare and safety of Ham. Those who quarrel over creeds shall be the lowest of the low. So their words shall have no effect. And the ships of Don Kili and Punt shall swim upon every whirling wave. No one is a slave but by his own consent. Mm -hmm. For he had no will to be free. Okay. It takes a painful stab to wake a sleeping giant. I mean, but woe betide him who makes the staff. The great troublemaker is near his end. His years have been numbered. When the new, when the new king shall rise upon the throne, 
then a united kingdom is set up. Many tribes shall revolt throughout all of Africa. That land will be the scene of many battles. Mighty ill uses force as the test of man and gives his might to those he wants to rule. And when those who rule grows oppressive, then he sets the oppressed over them. He executes the law of Li Ali, the master of eternity, of all things. Amdu. The Sin in silence, without protest, makes cowards of me. Mm. When you see something that is wrong, you, you are duty bound to correct it. He who cannot reason is a fool. Mm. He that will not is a bigot. Mm. He that dare not is a slave. All religions are merely the worship of God coupled with the worship of someone's ancestors. Let us have a fellowship of those who unite on the level above the differences that divide, that divide men as to the theories about superhuman and supernatural matters. For Hami Islam culture develops powers and leadership. The black man has to make a home for himself. Assalamu alaikum.